بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب زدني علما so what i'll be doing is here i'll be showing you the verification as well parallelly along with the theory the first step so i'm going to connect this topology with the three switches and we'll verify with a command called show spanning tree and from there we can verify these values with the show spanning tree let me show you this in our switch so i got my packet tracer topology here so i'm not going to use them right now we'll be using them later so this is my topology where i'm connecting a switch one connecting to switch two and switch three and you can see these are the links port number 21 22 23 these are the links i'm connecting so i want to just figure out out of these three switches who has become the root bridge so i just connected the cross cables i didn't do anything so it's a normal connection but i want to figure out who becomes a root bridge so let's go to switch one and verify who is a root bridge so there is a command called show spanning tree we can use to verify so when i say show spanning tree you will see there are two values displayed here so one value will be your root id root id means who is a root bridge where is the root bridge that information and the bridge id means the information about my local switch if we check the information about your local switch so my priority value is 32769 so it will be a priority value plus system id extended that is a vlan id and this is the mac address of my switch so my switch mac address is 0d00 so this is 00d0 i'll just write the first few digits and the mac address of the root is 0090 0090 means it is either this switch or this switch right because these two values are not same if these two values are same then you can say that this is my local switch is a root bridge right so these are not same so the other value is 00090 and if you observe here this is not the root bridge so this is not the root bridge other other parameters will see later on we are not getting into this status right now so i'll go to switch 2 this switch switch 2 and we'll verify here show spanning tree so when i verify the show spanning tree here again you can see the bridge id my bridge id is 0090 0090 and this is also 0090 0c50 0101 so you can see these two are same which means this is a root bridge so if you observe this message it clearly shows you that this bridge is a root now this is my root bridge in my scenario which means this is non root bridge and this is non root bridge so based on what factors it has decided again based on the priority value so in my case the priority value of all the switches are 32769 right default so which means i'm not going to disturb the default values so the tie breaker is based on the mac address so the mac address of this switch is 0090 let me write down the mac addresses and on the switch 1 what is the mac address you can also use show version command show version command to see the base ethernet mac address here so this is 00d0 and if i check the other switch the switch 3 show spanning tree i can use show spanning tree or show uh, just to check the mac address that is enough but this is the mac address 00e0 so if you compare the values so the first two digits are same so which means the tie breaker will be the third digit so this is 9 this is d d means uh, a b c d 10 11 12 13 so this is 13 numerical value and this is how much e e means it's 14 so which is better so least is better so this will become the root bridge so you can see the same verifications uh, if you verify practically also if you connect three four switches in the packet tracer you can verify that so as per my example who is the root bridge root bridge is my switch 2 is my root bridge and these two switches are my non root bridges